Hello and welcome to the third tech tutorial. This is still infinite EMC generation with what I've labelled the mushroom monstrosity. Basically we exploit a mushroom in this instance as opposed to a cow. This one I have not discovered a name for so I just named it myself. As you can see you build the same platform you do for the cow. Warning I will fuck up a lot during this. So please do not rage quit halfway during the video. But you use the same method, except you don't do that. All that. There we go, finally got a chicken. Now, not a cow, we want a mushroom, which is easily identifiable by its being red and covered in mushrooms. Basically, when you right click on a mushroom, you get a bowl of mushroom soup. So, similar to the cow with the milk, what we do here is we just keep right clicking on this mushroom to get bowls of mushroom soup. As opposed to using buckets however, we use bowls which have a really low EMC value. As I think it's for something like 3 wood in the shape of a bucket, you get 4 bowls. So very, very cheap to start off with. You need very little EMC to start off with. All you need is a mushroom or a philosopher's stone to transmute something into a mushroom. Then you can just build up the EMC as you go and start developing the machines to do it for you, such as these deployers here. Make sure they're all facing inward again. And this is not as quick as the milker because not as much EMC is generated by mushroom soup as is by milk. I just screwed up again. Now I'll be I'll edit my fixing it out. But yeah, you don't get as much EMC from mushroom soup as you do from a bucket of milk, as opposed to, compared to a bucket. But it is very, very cheap to start off with. Also, I'm very sorry if you can hear the slime slapping again. Stupid flatland world. I tried to do this on a normal world, but there was just so much stuff everywhere. And I spawned the forest, so that didn't help. Here we go, now you just put transposers all around the edge. And make them face towards the deployers again with your screwdriver. This is probably going to be the last of the infinite EMC generations videos. However, I'll keep doing more tutorial videos. As you can see, I've got more space in the background there. I plan to do something with power in the next episode, infinite power generations. So to do that I'll be using a combination of red craft, no wait, red power and industrial craft. Don't think I'll be using build craft, however I might. And then I'll do something like a um, mass fabricator, um, hooked up to recyclers and all, and just infinite you, you matter, that'd be nice. Maybe auto craft into a resin plate, something like that. Uh, as you can see, one diamond gets about 20 30 stacks of bowls as opposed to just a few buckets. So you can build this up really easily and it's very cost effective. As you can see, you make the, pretty much the exact same design as the Milka. And yes, there are no animal rights in Tekkit. There we go, make the pipe further away so that the mushroom soup chooses to go to it as a last resort rather than the first resort. And now all we need to do is set up a redstone pulse, with a minimum tick rate of 0 0.45 seconds of course. Oh, what am I doing? I'm setting up some kind of filter. Well, I did it wrong. If you put four bowls in the top, then it'll take up four bowls every single tick. So, and because the pipes are evenly uh, distanced from the deployers, it one quarter will go to each. So, one quarter of four, one goes to each one per tick. So, it's a very efficient system to use four rather than one at a time. 
There we go, jacketed wire, red alloy wire, and the timer is all you need. Also, daytime. Because it would really be horrible if all this got blown up. I'm not playing on peaceful for some strange reason. I guess it's more fun to have it on survival. Even if I have quantum armor. <laughs> you can go, as you see, it makes a lot of bowls, so it fills up really fast. About 10 bowls a time. All I just remembered, I did not turn down the tick rates. Let's see how long it takes me to remember. There we go, I got it. There we go, that's so much faster. As you can see, one is going to each. Right, I hope this has been helpful. Like, comment, favorite, subscribe. Do anything you want, really, if it helped. Um, I just keep screwing up today. Just trying to right click on transposers, silly me. And yeah, it makes diamonds at a reasonable speed, 70 EMC a time or so. And that is all. Goodbye.